Welcome to Drill Tip Tuesday. Here's your weekly dose of inspiration to build a creative habit, one drawing at a time. Brought to you by Sketchbook School. Today we are using a black pen, which is waterproof. And also I will add some watercolors. If you've been following me here for a while, then you know that I love to draw anything because everything is interesting when you draw it. So if you have run out of ideas and you still want to make a drawing, but you just really don't know what, well, draw your keys, toss them on the table and they will land in a position and then draw it like that. So I toss my keys on the table and actually they fanned out really nicely. So I can draw each key individually, but still have kind of an interesting overlap that can be a little bit of a challenge. So I'll just start with one key and I will trust my eyes and follow the shape that I see. And also don't worry about wonky lines or wobbly circles or whatever because your key ring may be round but if you draw it it's allowed to be wonky and not look round at all altogether it will look like a bunch of keys when you're done with this drawing so don't be discouraged if maybe you make a little bit of a mistake or it doesn't really look like what you see you can fix it just by moving along and not worrying about it this is supposed to be fun so don't beat yourself up about making mistakes Drawing your keys, you can do this anywhere at any time and it's a fantastic exercise to practice your skills. And each time you draw your keys, they will look different, even when those keys have been your house keys for years. So whenever you have no idea what to draw, take out your house keys and draw them. You can even add lettering. For example, write down which key leads to which room or door. Maybe a little story about it too. When you're done with your line drawing, you can add a little bit of color. I like adding a shadow because that really makes the subject sit on a surface and it also gives a lot of depth. And I'm just adding a little bit of colors to those keys just to give it a bit of life. I'm not spending too much time on it, just a little bit of color will do. That's it for today. And if you need more inspiration, there's a brand new course called a zillion ways to fill your sketchbook and you will find many 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 more ideas to fill your sketchbook pages with so head on over to sketchbookschool.com